is good everybody welcome back to another my damn toys video today we're going to be unboxing this massive bag from my boy christian from unstable 1047 he has a very entertaining youtube channel called unstable 1047 i will put the link in the description as you can see there on the screen he has an instagram as well you can go follow him he's a beast and we set up a deal for some figures and we also worked out a deal for a custom and these are the figures that he sent me so i'm very excited it's pretty freaking hefty i don't know what's all in here i, I know some of the stuff but i don't know everything so i'm very excited to get into it i unfortunately do not have the trusty knife for this video. I have misplaced it. I have to freaking find the trusty knife. But um, I'm not going to call this a My Damn Halls episode. I'm just going to make this a big unboxing of WWE figures here. And we're just going to dive right into it. But um, I guess I'm just going to have to tear it open with my bare freaking hands. But that's okay. You know, we, we have these hands and they're, they're, they're going to tear into this thing. Let's go ahead and get into this bag. Again, it's very heavy. I honestly do not know what's all in here. But we're just going to tear the little flappage right here and uh, see what we can get. So if we tear it right there, it did rip right open, and you guys will see. We're just going to open it like this so you guys can see every figure that we get here. The first figure that we do have is another SummerSlam Seth Rollins. This is the SummerSlam 2017 figure. It looks incredible. This is obviously his match with Dean Ambrose where he, uh, you know, teamed with Dean and they won the Raw Tag Championships. I don't remember if they were going in as champions or if they won it there, but uh, this is a great looking attire. I love this figure. It's a great one. I think this is like my fifth one in my collection now. So we got the Summer Slam 2017 Seth Rollins. We have his tag team partner at that time who will be going head to head at TLC this weekend. We have Dean Ambrose, the Elite 48 Dean Ambrose with the t-shirt. Great looking head scan on there. Um, they reused this head scan so many freaking times though. My god. So we do have the pairing of Seth Rollins and Dean Ambrose. We have another Seth freaking Rollins and it is the Elite 52 Seth looking absolutely beautiful right here. I'm um, just going to have to bend these arms down. They're a little bit weirdy. Um, but you guys can see, you got the screaming head scan. It is the SummerSlam 2016. Let me know down in the comment section below, guys. Do you like the 2016 SummerSlam attire? Do you like the 2017 SummerSlam attire? Out of the two, which one do you like? I honestly think I like the SummerSlam 2017. I think that this just matches Seth better with the burn it down and the everything. So uh, I think I like 2017 better. Next up, we do have another figure, and it is another Dean Meme Machine Ambrose. Let me know down in the comment section below here. I think this is the, the Elite 58. Which one do you like better? The Elite 48 or the Elite 58? Let me know down in the comment section below. I think I like the 58. I like the jean color more. Though both of them are more realistic colors. You know, they're not very saturated. This is a light jean. This is a dark jean. And the t-shirts are nice. So, uh, And they're both great head scans. I mean, it's literally up to preference. But they are great Dean Ambrose figures. Next up, we have another Dean Ambrose, it looks like. And it is the... Is this the SummerSlam? I think this is. Now we have the full tag team. Now we have the SummerSlam 2017 Dean. And we have this 2017 SummerSlam Seth to go together. So we have three elite Dean Ambroses, two elite Seth Rollins so far. Um, you guys see, I mean, the vari the variations in the Dean Ambrose figures are not very much different. Like, look at that. Three different jean colors, three different head scans, and all three nice. I mean, the, the shirts are the same, but they're still great figures. Dean Ambrose has some underrated figures. Next up, we have another member of the Shield. We have Roman Reigns, their brother, the Elite 51 Roman Reigns right here. Great looking head scan. I love this vest. I like the light blue color. If I can get his shoulder to come down here. And Roman Reigns always killing it with the figures. Hopefully he returns soon. Praying every day for Roman Reigns. Um, next up, we have another... My God, we have another Seth freaking Rollins, and it is the Elite 45. So we have so many Seths here in this video, and this is SummerSlam 2015. So now we have to take a look. We have SummerSlam 2015, SummerSlam 2016, and SummerSlam 2017. Isn't that insane? They've literally made a figure of Seth Rollins from every SummerSlam since 2015. So now what they need to do is make the SummerSlam 2018 attire with the Thanos, Doubt they do, you know how they are, Mattel, with copyright and all that issues, they'll probably not do it, but now comment down below, do you like the 2015, 2016, or 2017? I should have waited on that, but now you guys get it. Um, can't wait to make customs out of these and different Seth Rollins fix-ups. And then we have, yet again, another Seth freaking Rollins. We have the Elite 57, so you guys know how massive the Seth Rollins collection is. It just got even bigger here today, as we have the Elite 57 Seth Rollins in the WrestleMania 33 attire. Very nice looking. We have the gold armbands on there. I love this crotch piece because they actually put the belt on there. It's actually molded on there. It's not just painted. Um, you guys can compare there. Um, painted on belt versus sculpted belt. The sculpt will always win, but it did make his legs a bit wider. 
Um, it's kind of hard to see here, but you guys can see. Um, his legs won't go together as much as I would like, but uh, it's, it's still a great figure, great looking, you know, Seth Rollins figure. So we have Elite 57 Seth Rollins. What else we have in here? We have another Dean Mean Machine. So now we have not only the Elite 41, but we have the Elite 48 and the Elite 58 and the SummerSlam. So we have four Dean Ambroses, four Seth Rollins. We have one Roman Reigns. I do not know what else is in here. There's another Roman Reigns. So we have the Elite 45 Seth Rollins and the Elite 45 Roman Reigns. So tons of S.H.I.E.L.D. figures in this video, as you guys can see. That's the deal that me and Christian worked out. Uh, Got to spin his gauntlet around here. Got to figure out which way that's supposed to go. But I like all these figures. I think all these uh, S.H.I.E.L.D. figures look great. It's kind of crazy. I remember when Elite 45 hit shelves and like I was looking for them at Toys R Us and now we're on Elite 65 almost. So that's insane how many series and figures have released since Elite 45 came out. Um, and I used to look for it at Toys R Us and now Toys R Us isn't even a thing. I think we have one more figure in here. We have one more figure and oh my god Brad, he put in the Elite 10 Kane. And how amazing is this? I think he said he wanted to throw in a figure as an early Christmas present or like a Christmas present to me. And thank you so much, Unstable. Thank you so much to Christian for sending us this Elite 10 Kane. Um, this is a great looking figure. I love Kane. I miss Kane when he used to go maskless and bald and uh, used to not rock the shirt. And when he put the mask back on, guys, that was just awful. But this is right before, you know, he lost himself, in my opinion. Uh, we got some little damage on the head, but I can fix that, no problem. What an epic figure, guys. This is an amazing Elite 10 Kane. You know, he came with the World Heavyweight title and the Money in the Bank briefcase, I'm pretty sure. And I think that is it for all of the things in the bag. But my God, what a freaking haul, guys. Look at all these figures. We got Elite 10 Kane, and then we have a ton of S.H.I.E.L.D. figures. We got two Romans, a Kane, obviously, four Deans, and then four Seth Rollins. And we're going to be expanding the crap out of not only our Seth Rollins collection, but Dean Ambrose is going to have quite the many figures now. And I think I already had 18 Roman Reigns figures, so now that'll make 19 or 20 um, going forward so I can't wait to update the shelf now it's gonna be incredible I'm gonna have to move my Seth Rollins like before long I don't have to go along the whole bottom shelf um, let's go ahead and take a look at it before long I am literally going to have to uh, move the Seth Rollins because there's literally no room left um, you guys can see one of them's missing that's the top talents that I'm using for the predictions but before long I'm probably gonna have to stick them all like starting right here and then go all the way around um, and you guys can see the growing Dean Ambrose. There's still one missing. It's over on the MDT Live roster shelf. And then if you go up to the top, you guys will see the Roman Reigns. So we are the, the Roman Reigns are going to bleed into the CM Punks. The Kane will fit right in there nicely. And then of course the Deans will fit there. Maybe I may have to like move them around. But Seth Rollins, th those probably aren't going to fit. I'm going to have to definitely do some rearranging and stuff to fit the sets onto the shelf, but uh, that pretty much does it for today's video, guys. Thank you so very much for watching. Thank you so much to Christian for the amazing haul of Shield Elites, I guess we could call it, with a bonus Kane figure. Thank you guys for watching. Go subscribe to Unstable 1047, Christian's YouTube channel. He does great toy hunts. Um, he gives all his thoughts about new figures that come out. He uh, does all kinds of crazy stuff. WWE figure related, so definitely go check out his channel. Thank you guys so very much for watching this video. Comment down below what you thought about SummerSlam Seth Rollins. Do you like the 15, 16, or 17? Comment down below which Dean figure you like most. And don't leave out Roman. Let me know. Do you like the Elite 45 or the Elite 51 better? And uh, what are your thoughts on the Elite 10K? But that pretty much does it for today's video, guys. Thank you so very much for watching. Subscribe to the channel for more epic WWE figure videos. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at MyDamnToys. And I will see you guys in the next video. Thank you.